June 1st. It is June 1st. Happy June 1st to each and every one of you. Today and June 1st is New Year's Resolution Recommitment Day. Happy New Year's Resolution Recommitment Day. Back on January 1st, five months ago, each and every single one of you said this. I'm going to eat healthier, be healthier, make better choices, eat less sugary fat foods, walk more, move more. And back on January 1st, each and every one of you said, if I had time, I would do so much more. I would clean the basement this year. I would organize the spice cabinet. I would dust the house. Here we are in week 12 of our coronavirus quarantine shutdown lockdown. 12 weeks since we have been locked down. So, how are you doing on your list? Have you lost that weight? Have you drank more water? Have you walked more? Have you cleaned that basement? Have you organized that spice cabinet? Have you dusted the house? Have you been a nicer person? I don't know. But what I can tell you is if the answer is no, you're in luck. Because today, June 1st, you can recommit yourself to that resolution. Happy recommitment to your resolution day to day on June 1st. June And, fun fact, if your resolution was to eat more olives, if your resolution was to write a letter to a friend, if your resolution was to play truth or dare more, if your resolution was to wear a dress or put on makeup, paint your nails, you're in luck. Because today, June 1st, it's nail polish day. It's wear a dress day. It's olive day. It's pen pal day and so much more. Happy pen pal day. If you don't know what a pen pal is, that's because you're very young and watching this program. A pen pal was the coolest thing in the world back in the day. It's when you had a friend in a school somewhere across the country and you would write letters to them and they would get them, write letters back to you. It really was the coolest idea ever in the world. I want to bring it back, pen pals again. Uh, and now that we're in this crisis we're in today, it's nice to get a hand piece, you know, written letter in the mail. So happy pen pal day. Also happy olive day. Eat some olives. Olives are very good for you. Happy dress day. If you like to wear a dress, wear a dress. If you don't want to wear a dress, don't wear a dress. I don't care. It's dress day for you. Happy nail polish day. You like painting your nails? Paint away. Nail polish day for all of you. Also, today is dare day. Happy, what's going on over here? Oh, happy dare day to all of you. You know, it's really awful news. So, I have centipedes. Uh, every, this season, I get like two or three of them in the basement of my house and I kill them and they're big, like two, three inches and they have a thousand legs. Well, a million legs, like a trillion legs and they're like fast. They're like, I call them cheetah bugs because they're like fast. Um, and last night I killed one here in my living room and it was terrifying because I literally sit here and watch TV and right like three inches below where I sit and watch TV, there was a centipede under the couch, like flying out and I was like freaking out. So every like, now I see a shadow on the ground and I keep thinking there's more centipedes back and it frightens me. There you go. Uh, but happy Dare Day. Today is Dare Day. Today's day, call your friend, dare them to do something. Or don't. I don't care. It's your life. Live your life. But if you want to live your life to the fullest, Google this today. Google the Heimlich Maneuver. Dr. Henry Heimlich invented this back in 1974. The Heimlich Maneuver. Back in 1974, this was invented. And why it's celebrated today on June 1st, I don't know. Uh, but... It is said by the American Red Cross, here's a fact for you, that 3,000 people die a year in choking-related injuries. 3,000 people die a year in choking-related injuries, meaning the Heimlich Maneuver can save their life. If you don't know what it is, research how to get CPR certified and trained and first aid, first aid trained and get that training to be able to save somebody's life. You take it, up and out. So if they're choking, in and out, pop, the food comes out of their throat, they're able to breathe, they'll live forever. So happy Heimlich Maneuver Day, but most importantly, today, on June 1st, it is Say Something Nice Day. In the world we're in today, there is no nice. It's not good out there, people. It's not good. Say something nice. Kindness costs you nothing. It does not cost you a penny to be kind. Not a penny. Yesterday, 
It was National Smile Day. It doesn't cost you a penny to smile. Today is National Say Something Nice Day. It doesn't cost you a penny to say something nice or be kind. Be kind to people. Say something nice to people. You know what? And don't just text them. Anybody can text. Get on your phone today. I'm giving you all homework. Get on your phone today and call someone. Pick up the phone, call someone, and say something nice to them. It will bring so much joy to their life by picking up the phone and giving them a phone call. Or write a letter to a friend. That's very nice too. Thank you all so much for tuning in. It is June 1st, 2020. Here we are, people. Here we are in June. I'll see you all tomorrow on June 2nd. Before you go, a lot going on in the world today. So celebrate it, enjoy it, love it, because there only is one June 1st a year. Goodbye.